Okay, students. Previously, I explained about the evolution of money, importance of money, how the evolution of paper currency was started instead of the coins or metals. Now we are going to learn about the banking. What do you mean by banking? Bank is a place where we will save the amount, deposit the amount, or withdraw of the amount. And banks just save the amount, paper currency, or in the ledgers. If you see, what is a banking? Banking is a business activity where money deposits and collects. So where we can deposit the money or can collect the money. That is a place. Place where the money can be deposited or collected. So here, what is a modern banking? If we just go inside the bank. See, if we just all the banks earlier times, Initially, they used to follow everything on the ledgers, books, files, all those. But how the modern bank? If you go inside the bank, step into the bank, we will see some of the employees sit on different counters. And that is a deposits counter, one is a withdrawal counter. And in one of the cabin, savings or deposits, savings or deposits counter. So withdrawal and in one cabin manager will sit and these uh, the counter employees follows are having some ledgers. Ledgers means the books of having the debit and uh, credit ledgers just like files and registers and uh, sitting with the computers. Nowadays all computers only less following of these ledgers are the files computers so the manager also sit with the computer so this is a total system we'll see in modern banking it is a process of banking is very easier and faster than compared to earlier so what are in this what are commercial banks commercial means business trade so what are commercial banks commercial banks are the banks under so they give they give the loans for the business purpose for trade business commerce and industrialists or industries farmers or individuals commercial banks are the banks which gives the loans to the businessman and the industrialist farmers or individuals so how do they give the loans on the base of the interest so they will collect the interest every month or yearly interest from the businessman or industrialist so next the cash deposits what are cash deposits deposit or saving is the same so money keeping of money by the people in bank safely so why we need to keep the money to secure to secure ourselves or maybe it may, the robbers may theft from the thieves escape that is protect from the thief and robbers that's why or that is a uh, banks are the safe places to save our money so cash deposits means money keeps by the people in banks and next uh, saving deposits or saving accounts what are saving deposits or saving accounts so here for example so most of the empl employees have the saving account or the savings account to deposit their money here Geeta is uh, one employee she saves her uh, 5,000 from her salary every month and she goes to a state bank of Hyderabad to save the money. So for every month she saves some sometimes uh, she saves more money also. There is no limit as she want 5,000, 10,000 she can save in a saving account. And also some of the savings account linked to the salaries means most of the employers they will save the money of the salary of the employees in their account so instead of giving the uh, salary in the way of cash they are depositing nowadays in their account they will open the uh, they on their name and account savings account so every month their salary will be added or deposited in their account so they can withdraw their amount anytime they want through atm so they learn that is a atm means a automatic teller mission so that is through ATM they can uh, withdraw their amount. What is a basic savings bank deposit account? So kinds of accounts I am saying. Basic saving bank deposit account. We can say BSB, DA. So this is one kind of account 
we can open this account with a zero balance or minimum balance and there is no age limit means even the children also can open these minors also can open this um, account so no age and no income and no restrictions or conditions for these to open the account maximum four withdrawals including that is a ATM means they can go to the bank to withdraw their amount or through ATM they can withdraw that is a monthly four times in a month that is a limit and deposits and withdrawals of cash through ATM are checked so they can deposit their amount through ATM also we can uh, deposit no need to go to the bank and deposit our money and through checks also we can deposit our money and withdrawal also if we want to pay any amount to payments we can just uh, give the check and that person will if we give the cross check that person will go to the bank and take the payment so in that way the various kinds of methods that is for the withdrawal of savings of amount next uh, see under this under this basic savings bank deposit account bsbda so indian government plan that is introduced in 2014 pmjdy that is a prime minister jendan yojana prime minister jendan yojana PMJDY Prime Minister Jan Dhan Yojana. This is an account system of account introduced in August 2014 that is to access the account easily for the poor household. Means to access the account easily for the poor household at a zero balance. At a zero balance. So in addition, if they open this account, they have a benefit. What is the benefit? They can the government will repay the one lakh of insurance accident insurance for the uh, account holders who open the account and suddenly they uh, face this accident or accident occurs as they expire so government will pay insurance of one lakh rupee under this pmjdy account that is a prime minister jendan yojana this is a very useful account which was uh, useful nowadays even in the lockdown period also amount added by the government in this the people who are having these accounts Next we will go with next part.